what is up what is up what is up what is up so there is someone right they are secretly longing for you okay secretly in love with you secretly we have malachi transformation openness and love yeah this person is is <laughs> I don't know i just feel so much love right now like this person really loves you and and they want to let you know look we have blue highlight awareness confidence and calmness i feel like this person is gathering up their i don't know they're gathering up their strength to come and tell you however it is look the tigers are building courage and attracting wealth they are gathering themselves up they are trying to prepare themselves to be with you we have ruby wisdom wealth wisdom and success and love <laughs> what am i saying Sardonyx, happiness, stability to marriage and partnerships. I'm telling you, I know what I feel. At the bottom, we have Rhodonite, forgiveness, love, and emotional healing. This could be somebody who could have walked away from you, or maybe you walked away from them. And uh, this is for some of you. And for some of you, this is someone that uh, you're not paying attention to yet. But this person just has so much feelings for you. They're in love with you. They want to prepare themselves for you. They want to come back. They want to let you know how they feel. They want to make you aware okay they want to be open with you they they just want they want it all with you okay they want it all Ooh. What, what's just the look we have family they want to build a family with you they possibly you could possibly have kids with this person we have uh that's 23 we have 38 nourish your temple somebody could be 20 23 years old 32 38 i would say 83 but you know yeah 83 because you're never too old for love you're never too old to find love and we have look for the fairies 30 and at the bottom we have 35 meditate so yeah 30 somebody could be 35 somebody could be 30 somebody could be 38 23 32 but i'm getting like somebody's in their 30s okay so there's somebody who definitely want to grow with you they want they want their dreams i feel like this person is really working on their success and their wealth and stuff like that so that they could take care of you they could be the one to nourish you and uh help you grow i feel like some of you this is like for a small number of you some of you guys could be like single parents and you know you're raising your kids and you're doing everything by yourself and they, they just want to be someone you can lean on someone you can trust someone that you can depend on we have a new start is coming new moon look luck is on your side new moon is sagittarius show the world the real you full moon in aquarius this could be a, a sagittarius or aquarius or maybe from sagittarius season to aquarius season something is definitely going to be significant i see somebody starting a new business take time to breathe out definitely this is a uh, pairing up with the meditate card right here let me get the um but yeah look somebody they know that like i said some of you guys somebody left you yeah this going 1995 could be significant for some of you guys but we have the nine of pentacles and then the five of pentacles they know they left you they know they made everything hard for you they know they know and for some of you guys, uh, when they left you, maybe it could have been hard for you guys. But I feel like you coming back into this Nine of Pentacles energy where, you know, you have everything that you need. And you, you definitely don't need someone to come take care of you. They just know how much of a burden it is for you to take care of everything by yourself. They want to take away burdens from your life. You understand? They don't want you to feel lonely. I feel like, you know, even though the five pentacles could be like leaving somebody behind, somebody that's uh, missing someone, somebody that's feeling left out. They know that you feel lonely with the nine of pentacles. They know that you're really independent. You feel lonely and you, you have so much going on and they just want to really release your burdens, like release a lot of burdens from your life. What's at the bottom of this one? Oh, wow. We have the Knight of Wands. Yeah, this person, they want to come in fast. And you're going to get some sort of communication soon, too. Okay? Definitely going to get some communication. Um, 
Uh, might have wants to be somebody who comes, you know, comes in for, you know, to do that thing. But I'm telling you, they are longing for you. They want to use the, they want, they want that thing. You understand what I'm saying? They want that thing. But this person is also looking to love you. You understand? They looking to to be here for you, okay? This person knows that you're like not like everyone else. You know what I mean? Yeah, the Empress. I'm telling you. They like I said, they know that they left you in the dark. They know that they left the good person with the fool. I'm telling you, they want a new beginning with you. They know this could be for some of you guys someone you was in a relationship for some of you guys this person wants a relationship with you they're not letting you know that they want a relationship with you they want to nourish things they want they want a new start with you for some of you guys somebody even want to marry you okay somebody is is, is ready for marriage they want they want to go to long haul with you I feel like this person left you at a time where um, you were vulnerable, okay? You wasn't, uh, look, the time, well, yeah, because this is in the past. They left you at a time where you were vulnerable and you wasn't really exactly stable. You understand what I'm saying? You were still working on yourself. You were still trying to grow yourself. I feel like this person was really like a cop out. Like, they, they, things were a little hard and they left you when you were uh, in a vulnerable place. When it comes to your business, your stability and stuff like that. And now they want to come back. I don't know. Be careful. Okay, be careful with this person. Because this person is definitely with the moon card and the hermit. This person definitely still have some... Like a hidden side to them. Yeah, but what am I saying? Look, it's lies. Okay, this person could be coming back telling you a little bit of lies. This person loves you, but they're lying. They love you, but they're lying. And they could be lying about something that they've done. Maybe if you, you're the one that had left them because maybe you came into some sort of information. So you were the one that left and it could have been about some third party situation. This person is lying. No. They want to give to you. They want to balance things out. But there's some sort of lie here. Okay, what, what, what's this lie? What are they lying about? I do believe that it's about like a, a third party situation or something about going, going out, uh, a, a, a gathering, something like that. Maybe a pregnancy for some of you guys. <laughs> they, they, all right, they could be lying about some sort of home situation. Yeah. Maybe some. Maybe they want to come back because you're stabled and they want PC of what you got. Okay. Or they could be having some sort of yeah. Look, five five. The tower with the five five. The four of pentacles at the bottom in reverse. Okay, so yeah, this person definitely, I feel like um, they were in another situation. And that situation wasn't working out. They probably could have left you for another situation, but now they want to come back after the other situation didn't work out. They could have been like arguing and fighting with this person. They could even live with this person. Okay. And it's like after all everything that happened, and maybe this other person was the one that lied to them or had some and they they're starting to realize you. They're starting to realize what they let go of with the four pentacles in reverse. Okay. They're trying to I, I feel like this person's gonna try to make it seem like they were always thinking about you, but really they weren't. It was just after that person played them, then they wanna feel like, oh, almost coming back to you like a um like a safety net and i feel like you guys right now collective i know you guys are not no safety net maybe they felt like you were i don't want to say the harder choice but just you 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 were just too yeah they thought you were the harder choice they thought that you were just too i feel like some of you guys are really smart you know, you're really intellectual. You'll catch on to the BS. And they were afraid that you would catch on to their BS. So they wanted to settle for somebody that would just accept them. Not only to realize that they were settling for somebody that would just like them. Full of BS. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, this person is selfish. I'll tell you that right now. 
they're selfish they do what they want what was that that just fell out yeah they selfish they do what they want they want to give to whoever they want but i do feel like this person is learning through their lessons with the strength card could be a leo okay it could be a taurus a libra a virgo aquarius a sagittarius gemini but i feel like this person um i feel like this person is definitely <laughs> gathering up their strength right now to come and talk to you to make that forward movement but they're really they really holding back um that side to them i feel like this person is learning through the hard lessons they're trying to hold back the side to them where they were always giving to you know needing multiple people and they learn yeah they're learning yeah they're learning they're getting their karma all right they're not happy about it they're not it's so crazy because the first video that i posted it was about you know the karma coming back for someone this person is really not happy okay this person does not like what is happening to them they don't like the way things went i feel like this person is realizing they made a wrong choice and they're trying to come back yeah they what am i saying the two of swords is all about choice they made the wrong choice they made the wrong choice they're not happy with the choices that they made they were really blindsided by everything that, that happened to them. They didn't know that they was messing with a Knight of Wands too. They thought they was messing with somebody they could get over. Not only to realize they was messing with somebody. Yeah. Bad news after bad news. I'm telling you. But there is victory here. Okay. And I feel like you got the victory. Yeah. And love. I feel like this person needed. Um, you know like sometimes people learn like that they learn through through their mistakes they learn through uh shit being thrown in their face okay they learn through all of that they learn look page of swords yeah i feel like this person had to learn the lesson about whatever it is that they've done and and the people that they play with and i feel like they met they match they met they match and they learning what they do to people and how it makes them feel by it being done to them. But this person is watching you. They want success with you. They love you. They have. They, I feel like this person always loved you, but I feel like they were definitely afraid of that love. Yeah, they were afraid of it. They was afraid. They was afraid that you were gonna do to them what the other person did to them. They were afraid. <laughs> what is this? wow yeah so they cut you off and i know this is the will of fortune but i feel like this is definitely uh this is divine work this is what had to happen this person had to cut you off okay if you see here she has scissors cutting the string uh, uh, cutting off attachments um to you so that maybe they had to go through whatever they had to go through so that when they do come back they come back better but still be weird this person has eh. but also they're cutting off their options okay all these options they're cutting off for you they letting everyone go everyone they're letting everyone go mm -mm -mm. that's crazy all right i'm not even gonna drag this out just look forward to this if you haven't already please like and subscribe if you made it you know to this part of the video i really appreciate you guys so much because i should have said that in the beginning but i hope you guys make it to this part okay all right i'm gonna end this with a today's prayer okay because this person didn't even yo this person is i feel like this person is a little touched you understand what i mean like they 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 don't they don't know a good thing till it's gone they don't even know a good thing when it's right in front of them when it's right in front of them they don't know a good thing they only know once they deal with something else okay we have and we are confident that he hears us whenever we ask for anything that pleases him. 1 John 5, 14. 2011 could be significant. 2014, 2015. Okay. Um, November can be significant. <laughs> I feel like this person is... Um, this person is uh, praying for you, okay? They're praying to get back with you. 
they praying to come back we are confident that he hears us whenever we ask for anything that pleases him they're they're praying they're praying to god to to help everything come back the way that it should come back okay this person is manifesting you that's all i that's all i really feel this person is manifesting you okay I, this this person can definitely be like a little spiritual if not spiritual just uh religious but i'm really getting spiritual this person is spiritual they believe in some sort of manifestation um you know calling out the person's name um come to me you know stuff like that um so if you ever find yourself feeling like why you can't get someone out your mind why why is this person like energy like you can just keep whether you smell them you smell someone that smell like them or you see someone that looks like them this person is praying for you they're manifesting you okay they're trying to call you in wow you only know you was messing with the empress but look what you settled for now how you feel but worry not okay i do <laughs> So I do hear somebody saying, I'm not getting back with that person. Um, you might not just yet. But I don't know. I feel like you guys are definitely coming back together. I feel like this person that you really wanted at one point, but then you had to realize you had to let them go because maybe this person really wasn't the best for you. They was acting up. Okay, this person was cutting up. They was acting up, but it, it, it might just happen in divine timing. Oh, yeah. We have forgiveness, love, and emotional healing. For some of you, you just not looking into dating anyone. So you're like, oh, yeah, okay, I'm not, I'm not. No, it's, it's, you're getting success and love. Okay, it's coming. Don't look for it because when you go looking for it, you find something that you don't need. Just let it come, to, just let it come to you. I feel like this person is trying to call you, call to you. Don't call back to them just let them come they can't be a coward they can't be trying to uh put the energy out there and not come to you when really no trying to make you come to them before rather than them having to come to you it's an ego thing it's a pride thing no if they want you they need to come to you okay somebody needs to hear that message what's this five of cups there yeah, they missing you they're lonely I am so lonely. I have nobody. Who sang that? Who sang that? I forgot who sang that. Y'all let me know who sang that. <laughs> um, this is the person is saying I'm locked up. They won't let me out. This person could be locked up. <laughs> they can't wait to come home. All right. Um. I forgot who sing that, but y'all let me know below in the comments. Thank you for being here with your girl. I really appreciate it. I love you guys so much. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Next week, in the middle of the week, probably be posting more videos. I don't know. I'm not gonna make empty promises, but just keep a look out for these videos, okay? I love you guys so much. Mucho much. Mwah.